Hi, uh, this is Arthur Chapel here. I'm filming again in uh, North Manchester, in Boston. Um, this is actually outside St Dunstan's Church, which is a massive Roman Catholic church here in North Manchester. Um, this is actually the church that I actually was raised to be a member of. Uh, my local junior school was also St Dunstan's and the infant school as well, though I was thinking it was at St Patrick's even before then. So basically, I mean, most of my uh, childhood was spent in somewhat in combat with the Catholic Church upbringing that I had. Um, you know, I never fell foul of um, the tendency for priests to molest children, um, basically, but they were rather upset by my tendency to ask questions that kind of um, in, it pretty well told them that I was an atheist in all but name even in my childhood. Um, basically questions like, you know, where did all these other people come from as well as Adam and Eve and their sons? So he's Cain and Abel supposedly married other people. It's like, basically, but there's no mention of, of Adam and Eve having other kids. They would have been pretty incestuous if they had. So exactly where were all their uh, wives coming from? And questions like that, which would tend to get me uh, into a lot of trouble with the priests and with my headmaster. And I eventually uh, rejected the faith entirely when... Uh, I discovered that there were actually other atheists in the world. I mean, I first discovered that from uh, reading Joseph Heller's novel, Catch-22, uh, which was the first book I ever read that actually features atheists. And then, of course, I discovered um, Charles Darwin, and um, the rest is history. Or it would be if I had actually got sucked into a religious cult, even though I was actually a non-believer. Um, I did get involved in an atheistic cult. Um, sorry, not an atheistic cult, a Hindu cult. So eventually... Uh, kind of became an atheist again basically I became a member of the uh, Greater Manchester Humanist Group I was actually their secretary for a while but um, this is actually the church where my uh, conflict with religion began and it's still a very beautiful building both on the outside and on the inside I would like to have gone in to take some photos and film footage but unfortunately it's closed and locked at the moment um, basically but my sister actually got married here I actually gave the bride away at the fair wedding here um, basically mostly because my dad had died just before the wedding so I ended up stepping into uh, so I mean I didn't die literally just before the wedding it was about a month before um, basically but um, the wedding went on and um, I gave the bride away so that was actually kind of a big thing for me um, basically but that was actually right here at this church so it's played a big prominent part in my life um, basically and it's, uh, it's still a very nice building to actually have in the uh, Moston area of North Manchester where I live so uh, thanks for watching.